hello guys you can see that when i enable the secure boot it actually restart my pc and it go to the bios again and again you are watching here right now and when i again restart it it don't start the windows normally it go to the bios again so why does this actually happening there is a problem actually i'm going to disable the secure boot you will see that uh, my pc will restart in normal mode this is the actually not a solution because you want to enable the secure boot right you can see that my pc will start normally so here it is you can see the windows icon is appeared that means windows is normally opening so the reason behind is that if your ssd or hdd you just install windows on that that is in mbr mode what is mbr mode you can just that is master boot record so what we need to have is that we need to make that you can see that this one is mbr master boot record we have to make it gpt so when you are installing the windows you will see this skin to install the windows so you have to make the changes right now now press shift f10 and then this screen will appears you have to type disk part and then you have to type list disk it will show all of the disks or hdd ssd you have so this two is my ssd which is already in gpt so i'm going to convert this to mbr so first i need to select the disk i'm typing select disk 2 and now the disk 2 is selected now you can convert it to mbr i'm going to convert it mbr why i converted it because i'm going to show you how to make it gpt again now i'm going to select the disk again or show the disk again you can see that the gpt here is the star sign when it is in gpt and when it is mbr there is no star sign that means the disk 2 is now in mbr partition mode so again i have to select the disk now i'm going to selecting this one sorry i have to select the disk now i'm selecting the disk select disk 2 and now it is selected now make it convert it to gpt i type convert gpt and it's done now i'm going to show the list of disk again you can see that there is a star sign again that means it is converted to the gpt so this is it now we have to type the exit and it will exit from here and we can install so i'm typing exit and now you have to just click new here and then make the drive again and click next it will actually install the window your pc and after that you have to install the windows 11 i now i'm installing the windows 10 pro so this is for today i hope this will work fine for you see you soon and subscribe to this channel bye